Happy day, friends. Man, you guys have been getting a lot of me lately. Hope I'm living up to your expectations. Uh, today is a prepping day of, of many sorts. So they are preparing for paint at the house right now. Um, I am going to get moving boxes so we can prepare to start moving and downsizing here at the house and prep our house for listing. We have ran into some issues with the railing. <sighs> That's a long story. Is our very first big hurdle at the house and also there is also another hurdle in the basement uh, when it comes to finishing so I'm gonna show you guys all that stuff here in just a moment but right now I gotta go get moving boxes and then it's gonna be a daddy-daughter date day we're going to go get a toilet together as well as take down some lighting fixtures at the house and then while we're there I'll show you all the problems that we're running into so <sighs> I knew there would be issues at some point in this whole big process, so I just got to stay calm, figure it out. We'll, we'll figure it out. At what point <laughs> did these boxes become a hazard? I could have added more to my passenger seat, but I still need to be able to check out my mirrors since my back mirror is completely covered. Okay, on to home. I have a helper now. We gotta go get a toilet for the basement. You gonna help me? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, we are on a mission. Micah wants to find a, what was it? A, a blue toilet. I don't know if we'll find one, but we might be able to find one with a white box and blue writing. Does that sound good? Yeah. Okay, on our way to go get a toilet. What time would you say it is? Time to get a toilet. Oh, I was thinking potty time. No? Bad dad joke? Oh, okay. <laughs> careful, careful. Don't hit anything. Show them the trick. Woohoo! Okay. Alright, we are here to get what? A potty. A potty. Okay, which one are we gonna get? Uh, that one. That one? Hmm. I don't know. I think mommy might not like that one as much. How about we go look over here? You wanna come over here and help me? Oh, oh, oh. I almost hit the display. Okay, one second. All right, I think I need a different. Uh, I think I need a different cart. I don't think this. I don't think Daddy's strong enough to lift it out. Oh, you wanna go find another cart? Yeah. Okay, let's go find another one. Okay, do you wanna vlog? Yeah. Okay, you wanna film yourself? See how he's moving a big old tractor? He's doing that so he can get all the stuff off the top racks. Whoa, is that so cool? It's like a robot ladder lifting him up so he can get the stuff off the top. Why is he getting stuff off the top? Because people order things and that's where they store them. All right, kiddo. You're a vlogger? Huh? You're a vlogger? Yeah. Yeah. How do we get, get out of here? How do we get out of here? That is a good question. Where, where are we? How are you liking this vlog and stuff, Micah? Good. Is it kind of fun? Yeah. All right. Look at that. That's strong, huh? Got her. Say, got him. Got him. <laughs> okay, good job. You want to ride on top? Yeah. All right. Okay, I'm gonna let you focus on just riding, okay? You let me know if you get scared, but it should be safe. You're scared? Here, let me just push you one a little bit and see if you're still scared. Is that kind of fun? Are you scared or are you having fun? 
Are you having fun? Okay. Okay, let's go. You want a what? You want a treat? Okay, but we... Okay. <laughs> right here. You want to get one? One of these guys? We'll share it again? No, we can't do one of those. We'll do one of these and we'll split it, okay? Sound good? I can hold it. Okay, you're gonna hold it? Yeah, I gotta get the treats, huh? Hey. They are officially taping off the house right now, but I wanted to show you the roof. The roof looks so good, guys. So good. It is a giant relief knowing that we have a brand new roof that is going to take care of us for a very long time. Oh, man, did they do a good job. Seriously, that looks great. Oh, man. They really took good care of us, so. Um, I'll mention them again here in the future just because I don't feel like this is adequate, but um, they're just a local little family ran business. So if you're here in Utah, they took extremely good care of us. Definitely beat out all the prices of all the, all the local roofers. So if you're in the area, go to their website. I'll link to it below there, the Alliance Roofing and save that link, save that bookmark for when you guys need a new roof because they are phenomenal. Did a great job start to finish. I am a full-blown dad when I get so excited over a good-looking roof, you know? That is ridiculous. <laughs> wow, that's cool. Again, I'm gonna link them down below, so go check them out. Great guys. Thank you, Jets. Thank you for your service. Protecting this country. What's your favorite part of the backyard? Watching birdies from the flyby. The flyby? Ooh, that's a good one, huh? What else do you like? Do you like all the flowers? Mm hmm. Mm. It's nice. It's like a 90 degree day, and here in the backyard, it's not even that hot. This is wonderful. I love having this shade and the scenery. This is wonderful. Especially hanging out with you. Are you my best bud? She wanted to sit on these steps and she cuddled right up next to me. So I think we were overdue on for some daddy daughter time, huh? Here in like a little over a week, we're gonna have a freshly painted house. It's gonna be awesome, huh? Yeah, are you excited? Did you know we're gonna move into this house soon? Did you know that? This is actually gonna be our home. Oh, you want, oh, okay. You like being close to dad? Mm -hmm. Good. Love you, kiddo. Should we go on more daddy-daughter dates? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I have been packing like the last half of a day and I feel a little frazzled, but Austin and I are running some errands and, and getting to the house to, to do some things. And I have not seen the new roof yet, but it looks so good. Yeah, doesn't it look amazing? I feel amazing? like I'm like coming back to life a little bit. That I, looks really good. It, this house is gonna look solid when we're Sweet, done. that's awesome, that's exciting. The little bit that I've been in the house the last week has just been barely to do, like drop something off or do something real quick or get, you know, and I, came here the other day to look at the stair railing and I got distracted by that so I didn't really get to do what I came here to do. Oh gosh, they totally taped this place up. Yeah. Wow. The guy asked while he was here, he's like, are we painting your fireplace? I was like, oh no. He's like, okay, I'll cover it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wow. He, by the time it I got like, here, dude, the guy had it like, it was, it was holy like, crap, they even like, we should put a bow on that. <laughs> It looks like Christmas in here. Well, it looks like a scene of Dexter in yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, they'd be great at that. All right, so here's <sighs> it's, the... It's probably gonna be best, honestly, if we show them pictures on the screen. Maybe, like I don't know. I feel me. like you can you can see it in can the camera. Can you see it in the like, video? Yeah. It's kind of misleading, especially if you don't know what you're looking for. So I mean, no, it's not misleading. Come it's over here misleading. and look through the lens. 
Is it pretty obvious? Yeah. It's... Like, see Gotta, how those are two totally different colors? Yeah, but the guy that we hired to do this job was supposedly someone who has been in the woodwork business for 20 years, had been hired to work at like big time temples and churches and places to do very expensive woodwork. Whether that's the case or not, he really tried to rush through this and you can and see. And it shows. And it shows. It shows. <clears throat> like, it's really, uh, I don't know. It's just not quality. Like, look how different the color yeah. is. And, like, this this post over here, like, uh, it's just. He was supposed to have this whole thing done within probably about three days. And it took over the course of almost nine, almost ten days right. for him to kind of, like, come here. And granted, he was dealing with sickness at the time. But the time that he was here was very short, as you can tell, and it was all supposed to be done before the painters even got here. But this is legit like the first big hurdle and problem that we've been running into with this house. Yeah, I mean, to show you guys a little bit more, like, <clears throat> you can see the paint brush or stain or, Paul, like, I don't know. You can see brush strokes here, which is not... Well, it's not even brush strokes. Not good. That's what I'm talking about. That's where he took that... The sanding bit. No, I don't think so. I think that's brush strokes. I feel like we got catfished. <laughs> did we? Did we I don't get catfished? Feel like, I don't feel like that dude really did woodwork. I don't know. Like, I'm no woodworking expert, obviously, but I've seen people's finished projects who are not experts, and this is just not up to par. The guys that we are hiring to also do our paint and the interior as well as the cabinets, I don't know why it didn't dawn on me, but they also, they do woodwork. They do woodwork. Clearly, so. they're refinishing our cabinets. It never made sense in my head to ask them about the railing. Well, because we, like, we had a stair guy, you know? Yeah. And so yeah, he was true. recommending he was a railing this guy. guy, but maybe he, I don't know, maybe he got catfished too. Yeah, I think he did. <laughs> you know? So anyway, the guys that are painting the house are also doing this at the same time. So they will know the process and when to do this, which I think they're going to start doing this almost immediately. Oh, have to, right? really? I don't know. I don't so, know. So that's where we're at. That's the big problem. Yeah, so I mean, like every angle, you can just see something. Well, like this such, one's totally different color than the. Uh. It's such a bummer because we want this to be grand and beautiful, and the first thing when you walk in the door to see is the railing. Yeah. And like every time I walk in, I'm like, oh, your heart sinks a little bit. It looks worse. It looks worse. But Austin fixed this rotten spot with his friend Mason. Oh, you guys already saw that, so. Did they? This has completely rotted, and it's actually kind of bendy to step on, so just best to take care of it now before, you know, before we put brand new carpet on it. So it's easy, should be simple and quick, and um, we won't have to worry about any holes in our floor. <laughs> all done the disgusting spot is no longer there and it is arguably more solid than the rest of this floor because we nailed that bad boy and fit it in perfectly so <sighs> feels good to not have to worry about that spot because it was weak and when you stepped on it you could feel it was wanting to get it was definitely rotting so that's all fixed and repaired thank goodness don't have to worry about it anymore so feels good to get 
little projects done around the house. And boy, I'm telling you, telling all you, I hit the jackpot on friends for real. I don't know what I would do without my friends. Let me just say real quick. There is so much footage and time lapses and everything that we're going through. You probably saw a lot of it in this vlog. I don't even know what's happening. But because, well, it's because we only post three days a week, and but life lot, goes on seven days a week. Yeah, there's a lot going on right now. So um, if vlogs are crazy, that's just because that's how it is. All right, hey, real quick, we gotta figure out color for the island. Right, glad you reminded me because my mind is elsewhere. Man, he's gotta be really good at wrapping presents. <laughs> he's probably the He's probably Santa Claus, let's be honest. <laughs> Dude, Santa, that's what he does in his off time. That makes so much sense. <laughs> so these are all the colors that I picked out. Actually, these two are all the colors, but these are the ones that I've kind of weeded out already and we have got a lot more weeding to do, yeah. so. While I was here during the day, I did like the dark blue. The dark blue. I don't think we can necessarily go wrong with a navy blue. I was almost leaning towards one of these two. Maybe this one's a little more green. green. Or but maybe it was this one. This is like a duller blue. This is a, I know yeah. it's navy, but it's a little bit more blue and this is a little bit more gray. Like a slight gray. Yeah. Because um, I do not like any of these tans. Really? And I think that if you get the right one, it's so pretty and classic looking. Do, you want, do I need to show you a picture? Gosh, maybe. All right, being a husband, I've learned a few things. I have learned. If I give my input, Jess goes the opposite direction. <laughs> so I'm just gonna start rattling off <laughs> colors. <laughs> Gosh dang it, why do you make this so Isn't hard that on beautiful? Me? That is very beautiful. Like it's very classic looking and very beautiful. Ugh, you make this hard. Right? On me. I know, it's a very hard decision. And, and, and here's one that's even like a gray taupe. And it's got the dark floors as well. I like that a lot. I know, that's what I'm saying. Why are we looking at colors? <laughs> like I've done my Pinterest research, you guys. I have scrolled and scrolled and scrolled. Greens are in, blues are in, and hear me out. That's what kind of makes me want to stray away from the greens and blues because the greens especially are pretty trendy right now. And I feel like in a couple years, they are gonna Phase look out. like yeah, like old news. But I think the taupe is a really classic look. Well, the funny thing is, is our walls are currently taupe. I actually picked out a paint swatch. <laughs> one of them that was dang near close. So wait, why are we getting our house painted? <laughs> well, because the walls are different. I'm just kidding. It's different. I think I can rule a few out. Okay. Okay, so I think this is going to look too purple. So I'm going to get rid of this. Yeah, don't like that one. I'm going to get rid of this one. Yep, don't just like that don't one. don't like it. Yep. I think that this is going to be too light. It's going to get dirty. Yep, don't like you. Get out of here. I think this one's going to get dirty too. Yep, don't and like you. I think get this out of one's here. too pink. Yep. Is it though? Yep. Now like we're getting rid of all the topes that I like. Yep, that's too pink. I don't know. This Tony taupe is nice if you're here. You know, I really like, I'm gonna leave I like Tony Keystone Gray. Up there. I like Keystone, Keystone Gray, gray too. Keystone Gray is my favorite. That's a nice one. I think Thunder Gray is too green. It's too like, green? It's trying to it's be. It's literally gray. It's green. It's a green gray. Oh my god. <laughs> what? We but, weaseled our way down to these two. We had to turn off the camera to really get down <laughs> to business and we found a system that worked for us. Yeah. We've got sage green light and keystone gray. Um, both of these very similar in tone. Put them um, underneath. And I also think they complement the colors of the counter nicely, which is yeah. a big thing for me. But also, I just, I think they look good. Um, we, we also pulled out our light so we could see better. Okay, here, I'm gonna try to not be in the shade. Now, remember, you're also getting a little bit of red refracting. Yeah. But it is, they are darker underneath here. Yeah, definitely. For, if you're wanting to lean more fun, we could, do green. we could do green. If we're looking to feel more classic, we could do keystone. You know, looking at them like this angle, you can see it with the countertop, and I think I'm leaning towards the green. I feel like the taupe would be too similar. Yep, on board. Green it is. Green? Yep. Cool. I feel good about it. Yeah. I we'll see if it stands tomorrow when I come here in the daylight. If we hate <laughs> it, we'll paint it again. <laughs> I hope you guys agree with us on the sage green light. I Like I said, I'll come here in the daylight and then you guys can really see it. I feel like there's a lot of different light, uh, mm -hmm. color lights in here that are 
affecting camera. So yeah. I don't think you guys are getting a true representation by any means. So, but it still looks good. So yeah. hopefully, I don't know. We'll see if we like it or not when it's done. Maybe we'll just say like, "Hey guys, sorry, we hate this. Can you paint it again?" <laughs> Such is life, right? Yeah. All right, guys. Thanks so much for tuning in. We hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next time. Bye, friends. Bye.